Hello, hello, hello. Welcome today to a game called UFL. Now, it's currently in beta. It has been said to be the FIFA competitor uh, for a very long time. Uh, it's been in the works by a much smaller team than the Titans of like EA and 2K that might work on FIFA in the future. But it's in beta this weekend. I just want to try it out and see what it's like, you know, but kind of blind impression on it and see how it is. I see a lot of people posting it and, and streaming it right now, so let's give it a go. That looks like Victor, who works for us. <laughs> you can't, oh, you can't see. No, hang on. That's, that's Victor who works for us. Who's my captain? Do I want De Bruyne or do I want Ronaldo? I guess I guess just for childhood life, Cristiano Ronaldo, and we'll go for the lovely 4-4-2. Wait, is it like Ultimate Team? You know how to play online matches? Manage your club and improve your score for new players. I respect it. They've fully gone for it. So ab above me, I guess, is there's, there's CP and LP. But my club, this is my squad currently. So all players are in the right position already. Is there chemistry? How does this all work? They've got energy. I've got a better goalie here. I've got a better centre back. Say less. Transfers. So can I buy? Oh my god. Are you just buy players? As you can see, I'm literally just first. This is first time. I've, I've not even watched you play it yet. So I'm kind of just literally seeing and learning as I go. So I, this is like 13 million for these players. 12 million. I guess you earn money by playing a game. Oh, we finally got a game. Let's go. It's basic kit. It's cool. Both got Ronaldo. Okay, that's his team. We've got Ronaldo, Kaleho. Okay, so he's got a starter team as well. Can you, can, you, can you sell players? Where do the players go that you don't want anymore? All right, here we go. Hey, it looks all right. Oh. Het Nuspark. I mean, it looks... It looks good, no? Oh. Okay, UFL. Feels a bit strange. It's so weird to try and get used to. Oh my god. Oh, he's class, this guy. I'm on like, down in two minutes 40. This guy is about it. I don't know what I'm doing. How's on that? I genuinely don't hate it so far. His goal is right out. What the fuck? Pass it across. Oof, what all? No, this is good. This is, this is what we need. The whole, I think the whole thing here is basically to see can someone make a game that can at least make whoever, whatever company's making FIFA or, or EA or I mean, the 2K coming as well. But let's make them think more, you know? Like, how do we innovate our game further? Because competition in any space is always good for uh, innovation improvement. If you can monopolize a the market, then it's really hard to really improve. You don't, you don't need to improve. Oh! Did he move his goalkeeper? Oh, the goal is going crazy. <laughs> this is quite cool so far. Go on, go on, go on. Get there. Pass it. Do it with a turn. Cross it. Head up. Yes. 2-1. <laughs> so hey, why are you trying to pause the game, Hector? Just because you're getting cooked. You thought you was going to bang out after scoring in the second minute. No, no, no. I'm here, look, to show you. Oh. Connection was closed, but a server are timed out. So I'm guessing he rage quit. So he's given, he's given a loss. These are ranked matches. So did I earn money from that? I've got 12 million credits now. Do you get XP per players? As well, for the players as well, they get XP. And their fitness drops down. So you need to actually play, like swap people out. What does the XP do? Does it help them rank up? I've got 33 million now. So I qualified into qualification B. So now I can buy someone. Who do I want to buy? Really, I want a good goal kick. No, a good centre back. A good, a good centre mid. Market transfer. So I've got 33 million. You go rating. Let's say I want someone like 81. No, 76. A centre back. Nathan Ake. Ake wouldn't be a bad shout. 24 mil. But you need to have... You need to get these yellow points. Or does it cost yellow points too? Maybe I should get a French player there for... For Kem? Is there Kem in this game? I don't know. 25 mil. What happens? You 41,000 RP. How do you get RP? That's like reputation points. Sell now for 110k. You can sell players. My reserves have I got? No one. So I've got five open slots to sell. Okay, understood, understood. And what are these, by the way? You can get skin. Super skin pack. Premium skin pack. Eight skin. Should I open a skin pack? Open now. What's it do? Oh. Open skin. Zinchenko. Wait, do I need to have Zinchenko to use that then? <laughs> oh no. So you get skins for your cards or for, for players, but you have to then get those players, I guess. And then, yeah, this is for any... They're special for the... Oh, that yes, one's cold. Same all. He's got skills acquired. I can... I can. He's got a skill point acquired, so I can add anything to him. Add plus five to shot power. Let's improve his passing, really. Or his stamina. Ball control be good. I'm somewhat... I actually am somewhat impressed. So I thought this would be like... A, this would be a beta just to 
play the game basically like just get gameplay see what the gameplay is like and it actually seems like there's more to it than just that there's other kits in the store as well the servers are down for gameplay right now hashtag united are in here Oh, go on, son. Respect. You got spend doggy dog. Don't forget to hashtag it. Look, 3D badge in there. I oh, see so skins add player bonuses during the ranked matches as well. I can add it here. Look, Van Hoodson. There you go. Add that, mate. Give me some, give me some RP. So RP lets me buy players. That's what I really need. And I'll buy, I'll buy the skins because that's fun. I like that stuff. Uh, LP got quite a lot of league points right now. Any more boosters on that? An RP boost would be good. And right, the server's working yet? Yeah, will my opening work of my skins? Yes. It's the rare one. Who have we got? Tillemans. No. Okay, he's got a basic team as well. Hasn't bought anyone yet. He's got one win in the season. But from what it seems so far, maybe, it's like it... Maybe it does reward the slower players. So maybe people who play FIFA slower and more passing might enjoy it more. Maybe people who, like, relied on kind of ultimate team fast gameplay lives might not like the game as much. Oh god, that was awful. Yeah, go on. Get there, put a cross in. On your head, son! Oof! Ronnie! See, I actually bumped up my right winger's crossing as well, so Ronaldo could score me headers. Oh yes, to play. Bro. I'm cooking him. I, can, I'm, I might be the best UFL player in the world. <laughs> He's going to rage quit already, by the way. Fair, I respect it, I guess. Like, you're playing a beta. Do you not... Don't really care about losing. Here's my squad. Look, you see this guy's like... Hashimoto's now got two stars. He's got two and a half skill point for him. So I might as well improve... What do I want to improve for him? His passing accuracy. All right, here we go. Can I make it three in a row? Is this guy going to batter me? Because he's got all this custom stuff looking good. Hashimoto. I sent him in. He's off on the run. I don't know why I sent him in. running down the line, but it's fine. In the middle. Interesting save, it works. Oh, he man Mark Ronaldo there, he's smart. Me and him have got a good game going on right now. I like this, it's tense. All right, half time, nil nil. A good half, a bit of tense half. We've got balance plans. If you, can, if you can go attacking, you can go defensive as well. I don't know what it actually changes on here though. You get like a weird glitch effect, that's it. Oh no. We got custom tactics in the game. Not angry, I'm disappointed. He's banged it on the crossbar. Here we go. It's a moment. Ronaldo, he enters it, but it gets saved. We're in the ascendancy here. We're the team looking like, like just... Uh, uh. Go on, Lanetta. All the way. Are you in a pen for that? Oh, no, I'm terrified. Oof. 88th minute and I've scored. How do I celebrate? Poor guy. I feel bad for this guy. I swear down, he banged this in. Thank God. Thank God. We've won three games in a row. I think that's... It should, we should get something for that. Sure, we get some RP. Do we get some reputation points for that? We finished the game for once as well. How do you get reputation points? I want to buy someone. Come on. What we got in here? Okay. 199 CDM, 170 left wing, 199 right mid, 180 centre mid. Open this one. Thiago Silva centre back. Ooh, what's this one? No way have I got Diaz for the third time. Okay, well, there's my team that is currently at. No Ronaldo skills as of yet. Um, from what I can see by the looks of it, I think a lot of like, the big streamers and creators got given points, like RP points. We had to go into the transfer market and buy players, which I obviously haven't got. I've got 5,000 RP, which allows me to buy... Honestly, what could I buy with 5,000 RP? I can buy... If I sit around 75, I could buy players. Ramfweight, he didn't make it into the England side, but I could buy him. 6'5", centre-back. Not very fast, but he's 6'5". 5 player, 18 million. Now in your squad. Say less. Pelotti, wasn't he in like a packed out series at one point? What else can I get? I just want to get like a new look team. Play a game with my new look team. Pace away seems to matter in most games, isn't it? We'll buy him. 25 mil. Adebayo. Honestly, do you actually really rate this? It's very simple, very easy to use, very easy to understand. Adebayo up there. And it's, it's, it's a bit like, it feels a bit, it's like play to win opposed to pay to win. Because you have to 
play with your players to get them to be better and get like stuff for them and rank them up. Like level two, these this one is right? Hashimoto's level two, right? Let's add in microtransactions. You can buy stuff for that. It is a free to play game after all. It's probably going to be microtransactions, right? Then the skins thing's cool. I think the skins idea is really cool. And then you just do this, right? So I just go buy a skin. You want to get these. I think some of these help you get RP points. But some streamers have like millions of RP points, which helps them buy these players. You want to try and find some rare ones and then maybe you'd want to try and use those players. They get bonuses. They get better boosts. I could take a Taloy or Mkhitaryan to be fair. That actually would work. So we're going here. Library. Um, Mkhitaryan. I can buy him flat out. Let's just buy him, right? Because he has a cool card. Mkhitaryan goes there. Got Hashimoto. And then you go a few skins. Pop that on. You get plus 25 rep during rank matches now because I've got that one. Ooh, oh, no, no. What's his name? Look at that custom one as well. That's sick. But I can't afford him because I need Canate. Canate could work. Oh, these are cool though. I like these. And that, that adds like unlimited stuff they can do, I guess, realistically. Much more like it. So now you get bonus experience. They rank up faster now as well. Give me a game. Our final game. Can we make it four for four? Here's my opponent. Look, he's got a proper team as well. He put together a nice bunch of 70 rateds. Good save. Hope. Oh, and through clutch. All right, you know what? This guy's actually... Considering he's not won a game and I've lost a game. I don't know. It doesn't seem that way right now. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Adebayo. With composure and confidence. The shot fake. Drops a defender. Oh, my God. Before I know, the whole video completely unbeaten. Oh, he finally have like cards and I'll see reputation points. So I'm kind of curious if he actually will gain any reputation in this game. But I'll leave it there for today on UFL. You know what? Don't mind it. I feel like there's actually potential here. Obviously, the, the gameplay is interesting. It's a bit like, it's a bit bumpy and a bit slow. It's not as smooth. Like you touch the ball, it feels, a bit, it feels a bit heavy on your touches. It feels a bit clunky here and there. Just in comparison to what you're used to. Like you forget how smooth like FIFA is because you kind of focus on like, oh, the bad parts of FIFA. You forget how like big and actual actually well made that game is at times um, but we like to dog in it all the time don't we um, but you know what I like this like I said as always competition breeze innovation you're going to get a better product it's only a beta as well so you play like a FIFA beta before they don't feel very polished either so the fact that this is here already and they got I like some innovation to the game good job I'm looking forward to see where this goes actually genuinely so if you enjoyed if you like it as always subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys next time goodbye